Welcome back to Hoosier State Fishing. Fishing with the Hoosier State Fishing Dad. Actually, lives in Florida. It's been a long time, probably since I was a teenager, before before the Army, around that time frame. We're, it's, we're taking forever to get on the water, but but welcome back to another episode. We're going to creek fish for some monster smallies, hopefully. If not monsters, hopefully numbers. I'll take either or. We made it to the water. I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna peel over here. Peel and probably actually pee too. Yeah. I'm gonna go over this way on this side of the creek because it. Yeah. Hang on. I'm gonna come over here first. Here's what me and my dad came up with here. You know, this morning before we came out here, and I am in love with it already. It's a wading caddy. All it was was a cement mixer. You know, you mix cement in one spot, and we put some pool noodles and some zip ties, and boom, bam. You got yourself a freaking wading caddy. That's ingenuity right there. Some kind of ingenuity. All right, now listen, when we're on camera, I can bleep out our cussing. Try to keep this family friendly. And I'll, you know, I'll continue to backlash. Okay. And get it on film so people know that I'm professional. Well, turn it off. <laughs> Looks like a pretty deep hole over there. Water's cloudy. I'm gonna follow it up with a shaky head or something. Cause there's there's a fish in there. There's got to be. Is this happening? Okay. There's gotta be something in that little hole. Up there by that by that root ball up there. There's got to be. There goes a sucker. Or some kind of something. Did he really? Something just what was that, a frog? Something just jumped in the water right there. There's a bite, there's a bite, there we go. Yeah, a little guy, but yep. That's the confidence fish right there. What is that, a small or a? Small man. Yep. Okay, we'll take him, we'll take him. We will leave him, we'll take him and we'll leave him. Damn, he he wanted that thing. Yes, he did. He didn't want to give it up. That's a pretty little fish. It is, isn't it? They're beautiful. Hey, hey, don't put me in your pocket. <laughs> oh my look at that look at that right at the freaking shore right at the freaking right at my feet man i saw oh he's what is he wrapped up it is a small one. he's man he's going under my legs and he's wrapped around the shit gotcha. yeah i got him okay that's a nice one there's a nice little fish there goes the rod i can't believe that that's hilarious all that talking we were doing Oh, we were just talking and cutting it up and yeah that's good it's a nice little fish okay get in there let's let him go see you buddy man he was pissed he's like damn that thing wasn't supposed to hurt oh shit. It sure does bring back memories man it's been a long time are you on Dad's on. Dad is on. Little guy. Little guy. Oh, rock bass. Is it a rock bass? He's bigger than the whole rock. Hell yeah. They hate this thing. Oh, it yeah. Looks like a, looks like a bird. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It does. A bird's beak. The last thing you'll ever Dad see. is on. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Look at the size of that rock bass, man. The state record's three pounds. Pretty I couldn't even imagine. Isn't yeah. Three pound rock bass. I couldn't imagine a three pound rock bass. 18 inches long. Oh my gosh. It's a big boy, boy. Yep. I, I've caught him uh, 14. I caught a 14 over by the Eel River. Golly. Oh, that was a hit, wasn't it? I saw your rod. I was watching it. Oh, there we go. Started, just barely picked it up. Started, started carrying my line away. He may have choked that one, I'm scared. God, I didn't even feel that, Dad. Got him on camera. 
Yeah. <sighs> Damn, he is all chewed up. What in the world? Oh, he's got a hook stuck in him, Dad. Come and look at this. He's got a fly stuck in him. A fly? Yes. Your buddy. From a fly rod. Yeah, you're probably right. You believe that? Look at that. I'll be dog look at his, Look at him all messed Rusting up. Rusting out. Yep. Whoever did that um, got broke off. Okay. Look at that, man. He's all infected. Damn, he'll be all right now, though, hopefully. Oh, shit. Dad just got a hit. I just about got hit myself. Get on out of here. Look at that. We'll give that to Chris. It's good luck, my good buddy. Yeah, sometimes I have some methylate, but not today. Dad got one. I'm still recording. That's a nice one. Yeah. Hell yeah, man. He's, he's, he's barely hooked, isn't he? No, he's a good man. They fight like the dickens, man. Doing his job. Yep. Garden that, garden them yeah. eggs or fry. I don't know. He could be both stages at this point. Do you need help, Dad? No. Okay. No, I ain't no bird. I ain't no bird. Cool. Let me get a picture of you. And that, that, that lure was, oh, it, it was, nope, it got out of the way. Perfect timing. Look at that. I can't believe that. It's been slamming so far. I mean, really, yeah. it really has. Yeah, I'm just making sure. I forget all the time. My drag. There's one. Little bitty dude. That's all right. Get over here. Fighting like he's eight pounds or something. That one's been caught before. Has it? Oh, no, he's just bleeding real bad. Damn. I almost lost him. We're doubled up. Dad and son. I'm hooked up with something. I don't know what that, a little rock bass. That's a nicer one. Yeah, oh, that's a nice one. My yeah. Uh oh. As long as we keep he's him in. Throwing up, he's throwing up a fish. A Is he? Fish. Is he really? He's deep caught. It's all right. If we, as long as we keep him in the water, coagulate it should anyway, right? Yeah. Doubled up. Big guy, little guy. Yeah, I got to get this guy. Yeah, that's fine. Let's just, I'm going to let mine go. I'll hold your rod. Yep, I got it. He's good. He'll be he'll be perfectly fine. Yeah. Did he go? Yep. He's swimming away. It should coagulate, right? Yeah. If, it, if you don't tear any of the gill out. Right. I mean, it's like they can actually live through that too. Yeah. You'd be surprised, but uh, because they don't have predators here. Right. You let a fish like that go, and he's bleeding. Oh, it's done. <laughs> food food chain. Hell yeah. Dolphin would love to see that. Well, I mean, if they can still swim and they can still swim strong, yeah, they can still dodge stuff. They didn't survive for this many million years by being wussies. <laughs> uh oh, I got him. He's on. There must be a big old group of nests in their nursery or something. No, he's all right. About the same size as yours. Creek sharks. Huh? Creek sharks, that's what I like to call them. Wait till you get a big one on. That's a good way to break off right here. Yeah, these, this guy's been caught before I can tell. He's got a big old rip in his, this, this place must be, I can't believe, it must be pressured. Are you serious? I gotta follow it up. I can't though, cause I don't have my worms messed up. Another my worms messed up, I can't. He had, he had that smaller one in his mouth? Yes. Oh my gosh. Hooked up with the nicest one of the day. We're throwing that one on the measuring board. Dad, that's, that's a nice fish, Dad. Yeah, he's nice. You got him? Yeah. I'll worry about this. Dang, Dad. That's a good, that's a good fish. Let go. I got Ooh. him. I got him. 16 and a half. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Out of the skinny nice. little creek, man. Yeah. Look at that. Ready? Yeah. Got it. Good fish. Good fish. It's pretty amazing how big they get in these little creeks, man. Oh, man. I'm getting slammed. I should have brought toilet paper. No, just in case. I got a fish on. He was moving down current. I couldn't feel him. Oh, man. Look at that swimming fluke. Look at the size of that. Half the size of that fish. Hilarious, man. These fish are eating, man. One more cast. 
there's a fish. There we go. Little rock bass. Nope. That's, yeah, it is. Little rock bass. Trying to, man, his lip is all jacked up, man. I think these fish are just overfished. I really do. Had hardly even a top lip left. Old tricycle. <laughs> Not too awful old, I guess, but. Oh, it looks like it's from the 70s or 80s. Yeah. Oh, ow! Hit me in the sack. Huh? Came right back and hit me in the man. Damn. Sack There's something coming out right there. Suckers. Suckers. Yep. There's dad's on. Little, little. little guy. Yeah. Looks like uh, saltwater fish and freshwater like that olive colored. They love that olive color. Yes, they do. It's really natural. I'm so glad that uh, the power keep making it you know what i mean i've had them i've had them quit making stuff that really worked for me i've caught some big smallies i think my biggest which is what i say that's not there dad's on dad's on it's probably gonna get off i didn't set no hook it's another little guy right up under that log too aren't they yeah they are looks like they're on the bait fish bite more more predominantly than they are right bottom here yeah they gotta take what they can get right big boys are on these guys. Yep, that's right. The big smallies are looking for something about this size to eat before this storm comes in so that they can get their belly full. Yep. There we go. Oh! Son of a gun. I hate hooking them and getting off, man. They're going to go tell their friends. Oh, man, I'm getting little bitty guys attacking me. Yeah, there's a big bluff wall. What do you call them birds? Swifts or Martins? I'd like to swiftly catch a smallie out of this little hole right here, but they're proving to be a little more difficult to catch than I thought. I don't know what's going on here. I'm about to throw a uh, shaky head up in there just in here in a second. Just trying to see if I can. I had a nice hit just a minute ago. I'm gonna try a shaky head up in there. See if that can produce anything. It's a terrible cast, but what are you gonna do? There's one. That one knocked slack in my line. Yeah, a little bitty guy, a little, little rock bass. That's all right, we'll take those. Man, the beautiful eyes on this fish. Look at the eyes on that fish, man. Squeaker. It's okay. They're fun. They are fun. Right up on that log, man. There's one. Oh my gosh. Little bitty dude, another little bitty guy. I got a sucker, Dad. That's awesome. I did. I am too. That's neat. He thought that was a catalpa worm. That's what that looks like. A what? A catalpa tree worm. Really? How big do they get? Oh, they get about that big. Okay. Oh, they're spotted and green. Oh, really? Yeah. Look they're at that. Spotted and green, and they are a killer bait. Your uncle Fred, or your great uncle Fred, and Grandpa Helfenberger, your grandma's dad. Yeah, they were all over. They were. They take me up in the bushes, get me all covered in poison ivy. <laughs> Mom, it's for yeah. bait. Huh? To get bait. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's funny. Oh, Burton. He. <laughs> Actually, it was the Helfenbergers that were into that. But didn't you tell? Aren't they in? What was the worm you told me that was they live in stalks? Uh, horseweed worm. Horseweed worm? Uh, catalpa worms live on the leaves of catalpa trees. Have you ever seen a catalpa tree? I don't think so. Oh. Damn it. He got it. Uh uh. Yes, he did. Broke it right off. That was a nice fish. Damn it. I saw it. Broke it where? He broke it. Whoa, man, get some air. That's a nice fish. Yeah. Ooh, he's gonna be blind in that eye. Huh? He's gonna be oh, blind. Get yeah, yeah. Right through his eye. Let me see. Ah, uh, darn it. He's done. As long as he's got one, he'll be able to, he'll be yeah, fine. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Want a picture? No, it's all right. Got it on video.
Oh, did you? Yeah. You got that all on video. And our story about the Catawba worm. That... What a gummer. Yep. That's my favorite lure. Man, that was a. That had to have been a nice fish. Oh, I saw him. He was a nice one, all right. I just can't believe he broke it. Damn it. All right. Well, what do you want? Back out there with something. I might go through your stuff. That's fine. I've got. I don't know. I'm trying to brought my tackle back. <laughs> little bitty guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> little. Ow! Man, that's twice it's come back at me. Getting revenge, revenge of the smallmouth. Hooked up with a nice and I was messing around with this rope, trying to get it undone. Holy crap, he's taking you everywhere. Oh, oh, oh man, that's a nice fish, Dad. Dad, that's a 20 inch fish. Oh, Dad, don't let that fish go. Oh my gosh, that's a that's an 18 at least. Look at the size of that fish. Yes, sir. 19. Look at that. Look at, we're in a foot of water. I know. Two it. or three feet over I'm there. in this shallow pool. Golly. I'm taking a picture of that. and I don't know where, there goes the freaking thing. I let go of the rope. Stay there. It's got a, she's got a belly on her. She wants loose. Wow. Can we let her go? Sure. Oh, I wish you'd have got that fight with him. Man, I did. Well, I did. I didn't get you hooking it. I didn't oh, get you, you hooking her. Yeah, yeah. On the Ned Rig. Look. The Ned Rig, man. Man, what a fish. It makes it that much more special when it comes out of this little little waters. Yes, it does. This little skinny water. Yep. Get it up there. No, no, no. Get away from me. There you go. There you go. I'm going to let it sink for a minute. I am too. Oh, that was a hit. I might have just broke off. Broke? No. It's still there. No, it ain't. Took my freaking, took oh, my bait off. Worm. The worm off. Took the whole big swim bait off. That's got a belly full of plastic. That makes me so mad. Oh, you ran out of them? No, well, I'm just saying, I just don't like them having a big belly full of soft plastics. They can throw it up. Yeah. But they like the way it feels in their stomach. Oh, yeah. that's another nice one. This one's on video. Oh, oh yeah. Got that's a, Is that a large mouth? No, it's a smallie. Oh, I think she swallowed it. Just about what I was going to take. Whoa. Oh, my. Where are we at here? Shnikes, we got a lively fish. It ain't nowhere near the size of the last one you got, but it's a big one still. 16. Yep. Oh, no, you're good. I mean, right on the outside of the lip. Oh, okay. I thought it was just swallowing. I thought so, too. Oh, Derek set me up with the Ned rig. I'm telling you, it slays. That's a spawned out female, man. Look yeah, how skinny it is. There's one. Oh, my gosh. Mm, I got to get back out there. Hang on. They're all up in this little area right here. I got hung up and was coming over here to get unsnagged and fell over right where Dad's standing. Can't believe we didn't scare him away. Obviously, they didn't care. About a 14. All day. That first one I caught in here would have been a good tournament fish. Oh, heck yeah, it would have. Man, they were stacked up in this little hole right here. Dad's gone. <laughs> it's that Ned rig, man. You cannot, you can't go wrong with it. I almost fell on my butt again. Yep. Oh. That's yeah, true. They're hard, hardcore cannibals, just like largies. Yeah, all, all is down. It looks like it. Like well, I guess that's it. I brought a brand new battery out, and it's completely dead. One percent remaining. What are you gonna do? Pretty good day of fishing, anyway. We're not done. That's that's for damn sure. We're gonna continue to fish. Yeah, like I said, he's used to fishing. Right or, or creek fish, you know, it's like you just try, you try to record a nice video and people are going crazy on the roads. Anyway, hey, so that that video was uh, was pretty special. I haven't been fishing with my dad in uh, quite a long time. I'd have to say probably since high school. After high school, I joined the army and did that whole deal for six years and 
was gone out of state and deployed and all that good stuff so never really got a chance to, to get home to visit and you know to fish together and stuff so it was really nice he, he, he now he lives in Florida um, but he came up to visit so I just decided we're gonna take a day and we're gonna go fishing we're gonna go do some creek fishing for some smallies he's obviously nowadays is used to fishing the oceans and brackish water and stuff but he obviously hasn't lost his touch when it comes to creek fishing and, and freshwater fishing. So, but yeah, and I figured I didn't even realize it till just now that uh, this weekend coming up is Father's Day, so it's pretty much a it's a pretty fitting video. So get out there and fish with your dads, man. Even if they don't like to fish, take them out and get out in the outdoors, go camping or do something. You know, have a have a good bonding, mushy mushy moment with your dad. It's it's important and it mean it means a lot. So happy Father's Day to all you dads out there and soon to be dads. And, Thanks for stopping in, and uh, we'll see you on the next one.